Hi y'all, welcome to Heritage Homestead Journey. I'm Little Miss Homemaker. And today we have some friends over from Whippoorwill Holler. Can you guess who those are? I guess you can because they're the only people I know from Whippoorwill Holler. Actually, I'm uh, grilling chicken. See there? Look at that. Hopefully, it'll get done before tomorrow or before supper. Why so many? Because we've got guests. Mm -hmm. I don't care. Man. We've got Mr. Danny and Miss Lori here from Whippoorwill Holler. So we have a guest with us. Um, so I just want you to tell who you are, what you do, what um, on your channel, and where you are right now. Okay. I am Lori Brown. I'm from Whippoorwill Holler Homestead, and uh, we homestead. We have chickens, and we do um, just a lot of sustainable being prepared for hard times uh, it's just been part of our life we cook we bake we what do we do we do all kinds of uh, ferments and just everything you think of that you would do on a homestead okay and uh, mr. Brown was in here he'd probably tell us more I can't even think of what's <laughs> Do you like homesteading? I love it. I've done it all my life. That's how I was raised. So that's all really I know. So, yes, I do love it. Do you like it? You're kind of a traveling homesteader, the way I see it. Basically, that's yes. That's right. Yeah. And you're very good at it, too. Thank you. <laughs> I like I like it. I do, too. I was raised by a grandma that... Uh, we had about 160 acres, and we had cattle, and we raised hogs, and a bunch of chickens, and of course everything that we put up, we raised ourselves, and also processed ourselves. So it was always a big ordeal, but we always had plenty of food. And we raised a big garden all the time. My grandma, you know, she never went to the grocery store. We sit and buy flour, stuff like that. You know. So it's just the way we was raised, and Mr. Brown was raised that way too. So that's just, that's our life, and so that's what we do on our channel, is just try to show people how you can do things easily, homestead, and it's not a hard thing to do, it's just part of your life, what you do, to make it easy. You have to prepare, that's for sure. If you're going to be a homesteader, you have to prepare for hard times. For any time. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you. Thank you. I love you. I want to give you a few results on this campground that we're staying at. So, it's in Arkansas. And it's awesome. So, here. Hold on, I'll turn So. There's a lake and you can go paddle boat riding. There's two playgrounds. One is right over there behind that building. Um, plenty of space to put an RV. We're a 41 foot and we fit, so that's great. 
And then I'll show you. There's a trail and there's ghost buildings. Now if any of you don't know what a ghost building is, well a ghost building is just where a building used to be and it's not there anymore. That's all it is. A building that used to be there and the people here are very friendly. There's quite a few trails and if you don't like riding on bumpy um, gravel, they have smooth driveway if you bring a bike. And so, yeah. So, thanks for joining me. drained it over the vegetables to kind of soften them. Good and idea. So, if you don't like crunchy onions, well, they're still crunchy, but... Not... It didn't really... <laughs> it sounded good. Disclaimer. She's <laughs> fibbing. <laughs> All right. And take store. And uh, I oh, just love stuff like you. that. I love it. Thank so, you so much. You're welcome. I have bowls that were my mom's that have flowers really? on them, and they're my favorite. See, when I this is my favorite stuff like this. Mm -hmm. You can't give me no that, stuff. Me either. I want this stuff. Show yep. to us that so uh, we turned pretty. it over so you. You're welcome, Bug. I had them shipped in. I hear my voice. They're scared of Danny, but it's funny they all stand. Yeah. You know you've been a good friend. And that's in the thick and thin. And I know it's never gonna end. Cause you've been a good friend.
pulled the sheets off your bed yep. so you can play with it? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Well, that's awesome. You haven't stopped playing with it since you got home, have you? Not even one single second. Well, maybe a second or two. <laughs> See you next time. Bye.